Malaysia GP is now behind me. Um, very, very up and down weekend. Uh, more down, unfortunately. <laughs> Uh, qualifying again very very strong. I mean it's very strange. Right? We're so strong in qualifying but struggling a bit in the race and in qualifying you know we, with the car we have we can fight for a front row um, and then you go in the race and t this time strategy wise everything was going well. I was um, P4 I think after the red flag and after the pit stop there so that was good and from then on I thought okay maybe now I can I can do something good this time and then it just started going backwards but big time and with the first intermediate I had to come into the pits because I just thought my rear tire was game over completely. So I come in the pits, put a new set of inters on, go out, and the pit uh, crew says to me that my, my uh, inters were actually brand new still. And I'm like, what's going on? They, they felt completely destroyed, so it's just very strange. And then from then on, it was just getting worse and worse and worse. And okay, in the end, going on the slicks, a little bit of a highlight that I managed to um, beat Jensen, which was nice, but you know, fighting for third place, um, not really worth mentioning. Um, anyways, there's a lot of work ahead for us because still struggling in the race and it's uh, going to take some thorough analysis and we have enough time now for China so I hope we can improve and, and then I'm looking forward to China to finally get a better result and my season starts there more or less.